Hello everyone, this is Rich Cespedes and I'm here to analyze the famous video of Nina Kalagana, 33 year old Nina Kalagana, as she uses her telekinetic abilities to move objects and I'm here to describe everything about how she's doing it and how we can better efficiently copy and get results like her. Now right here, she's in front of the, of the scientists. Here's a, here's a good example right here. She's moving a group of objects that are clumped together, the matches and the box together. Now I think that this is a better efficient technique because instead of focusing all your energy on one object, you're just letting your consciousness and awareness uh, focus on all of the objects that you're seeing. Why? Because you're letting anything and everything be affected by your telekinetic presence. Now you can see right here she's emotionally drained. You can see that because she's applying all of her being, her mental and emotional energy in the object for it to become her. It's her daughter, her son, it's your buddy, it's your friend, it's you, you know? That's how you connect and make objects move because it's extension. Now right here, now right here again, she's moving a clump of matches together. Why, why that works? Because she's not focusing on one thing or one small thing. She's focusing on, on the totality of what she's looking at. And she gets more results by moving anything and everything without having to use too much energy on one object. Right there, she's drained again. You can see her. She's drained because she's applying all of her mental energy in that. Physical, emotional characteristics in it. Right here is another more earlier video. I think it's the 70s or something like this. more older. She's manipulating uh, that machine. Now all this... Now right here again, she's utilizing the technique where she's not focusing on one thing, draining all of her energy on one object. She's just throwing out all of her physical, emotional surgeons of energy out so that multiple objects can, will be affected by her. It's more efficient that way and more enjoyable to do because you get more results out of just letting your energy go and just by chance the uh, any object around you three or four objects clumped up or not will be affected by your telekinetic energy and move all in all you have to consider the totality of the situation that's going on the totality of your intentions the totality of the environment in which you're in the table that's holding the object that you're trying to move with your energy has to be also in consideration everything that's around you you're not trying to move the table but you have to consider it as being a part of what's going on you have to be connected as though it is a part of you you have to bring life into what you're trying to do you have to be totally aware and on top level emotionally on what you're trying to accomplish you have to consider everything that's in front of you and to apply every little bit of you into the situation and into the objects that you're trying to move don't focus on one object too much just let the energy flow out on all directions so that you have more chances of moving anything and everything around you it's ricky says but thank you for watching